hi guys welcome back to my channel step campus so in this tutorial of night watch we are going to talk about the drop down okay so how we are going to select this drop down uh, element let's go to the google chrome and then we will see the first website of this one okay so this is a website over a drop down okay i will give this link in the description box you can uh, use this link for your testing purpose okay so basic element only drop down button has present here and we are going to interact with this element so drop down button is such uh, type of button where we uh, where we have uh, hidden options okay when you click this down arrow so you are going to see the different different options so for an example let's suppose we are going to select this thor button okay uh, by default black panther is selected but no we want to select a thor button so how we are going to do this one let's get seen this video okay so for this one i will go to my visual studio code editor okay and in this test folder i will create one new file of drop down drop down dot js we have to give okay yeah and then we will start our basic syntax module dot exports who are not understanding about this syntax i will request you all to go from the first lecture and then come to this lecture to do further validations okay i have already given all the syntax there how to use this syntax okay so i'm not going to tell here because it will take lots of time and the video will also increase it in time so let's get started so here we have to give the test suit name so in double quotes we are going to give the test suit name after test suit name is drop down you can give any test suit according to you okay and then we will pass browser inside function browser is same like a driver in selenium okay now uh, we have to interact with the url so to interact uh, to interact with the drop down uh, we have to first go to that website okay so for getting website we have to write browser dot url okay and then inside double quotes we have to give this value not this value the website value okay website link just copy this link here go to your editor paste here don't give to for uh, forget uh, don't forget to give this uh, uh, semicolon is a good practice in javascript and then give some pause browser dot pause and give five uh, seconds okay save it and run it let's see how it is behaving according to us it will open the url okay let's see okay so you can see this url is open here okay uh, black panther is selected for the first time and after five second it is after five second it was uh, again close this web page okay now now we have to interact with that element right drop down and we have to select what thor okay so just to inspect this one okay just inspect this one click on this button and then click on this black panther so you will get a drop down selector copy copy selector okay css selector we are using here then we have to give see so to interacting with that double uh, drop down uh, we have two options okay first option is uh, give it as a comment first option is using set value okay and second option is using click click option okay using click so first we will see the using set value okay so how to set value browser dot set set and v capital okay always remember and then we have to give the uh, css selector okay now we have to give the actual what we are going to pass so we have to select thor right so give t h o r okay thor then give semicolon and then give some pause then give some pause i am using the same pause here five second pause let's run it <coughs> it will take time so sometimes it will to open the browser but not an issue you have a patience to wait okay yeah you can see the black panther has by default selected but we have selected for the thor okay we got some error let's see what is the error uh reference error thor is not defined okay yeah see what is the error why we are getting uh, this error see the set value is taking a string right and we have given this thor so this thor has no any reference okay so we have to pass the thor in string format always remember okay 
why i am uh, telling you all this so it will help in your script writing okay so this thought should be in string format okay if you give this thought then this thought has no any reference here okay now save it and run it again definitely it will pass this time okay all negative scenario i will take care and i will teach you also because this is very important i think uh, when you are talking about the basic part okay yeah black panther now it should select thor yeah we will wait for some time yeah thor has been selected here after 5 second it will uh, close the browser okay now fine now fine okay what happen if i don't give thor because t is capital there okay what happen if we give t is small and not give the full balloon just give th okay let's see is it selected or not thor has been selected here or not uh, we will see sometimes it will take some time but yeah i am telling again and again we have to wait yeah black panther by default and it should select thor let's see oh good we can select thor by giving this th also okay so it's a very good so i am telling you i will give you very small small concept also okay now a uh, first option is done okay we have seen the interaction of drop down with uh, set value method now we are using to uh, see with the click method okay so how we are in browsing click so browser dot click we have to use and then we have to give the x path not x path css for this time we can give x path also but uh, that is a different concept i already told you for using x path we have to use some function that is uh, use x path okay in this tutorial in this tutorial in the previous tutorials okay okay now drop down and then we have some certain uh, certain syntax we have to follow option nth child okay so when we have to click now so we have to click in this format like we have to give the index one okay so this syntax you have to follow when you are using click method to interact with the drop down okay this is index so what we are giving we are saying just go to the x path or, or css whatever it will be okay and we have to select option because drop down we have options and then in this options we have some values right so we have to go to the nth child okay all the all are the child of child and then we have to give the index which child we have to select so as of now we are giving three okay uh, let's go to the website first let's see what is in three three will be hulk okay thor already we have seen just see about hulk okay third one uh, i will show you the index also index is like this way black panther one black widow second hulk three and thor four okay so we have given three it means it will select thor for this time oh sorry hulk this time because hulk is in three index third index and then we will give some pause here also just give us five second okay just save it and run it you already know how to run this uh, command to run the script right if not then i will tell you again and again go my to previous lecture and then see okay so black panther selected by default okay then it will select thor okay and now it should select with the help of click method hulk 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 is been selected you can see here okay so this is the concept of drop down okay guys so i think it's very easy if you have any doubt then just reach out to me in the comment section i will uh, give you as much possible answer there okay and if you have more doubt then i will create another video of that one also which are not an issue okay i am here to help you just follow the lectures just complete complete these lectures from starting and subscribe my channel okay so in this video that's it guys we will see you in the next lecture happy learning thank you bye bye